Thanks for joining us. An effort to beautify downtown Ashland vandalized this week. People noticed unauthorized and inappropriate additions to artwork that was on the walls. News Channel 3's Andrew Colgrove spoke with one of the artists whose work was affected. Downtown Ashland has seen something of a makeover the past few years. They did it as part of revitalization, make people excited for our town. Growing displays of murals painted on buildings, including here in the alley behind Winchester Avenue between 15th and 16th Streets. Make it a more colorful, just a place that people want to be. Madeline Tipton is one of the artists that's contributed. I don't want people to be discouraged from getting a mural or investing in our community. She was disheartened this week after learning someone drew their own inappropriate additions over top of five of the murals. A to not be too graphic, it was some male body parts. She says fortunately they were able to clean off the graffiti without having to paint over it. Thankfully the magic eraser and the rubbing alcohol worked really well. We put a lot of work and time and a lot of building owners, business owners and just people throughout town have invested a lot of money and time into these projects as well. So for someone just to go do this for 30 seconds of entertainment, um, it was just overall annoying. Miriam Howard works in one of the buildings that was hit. It was just really disappointing and upsetting to know that someone would do something like that and just ruin such beautiful or try to uh, destroy such beautiful artwork. Why would someone do this? What is even the point? Disappointed their effort to contribute to the character of the city would be defaced this way. Andrew Colgrove, WSAZ News Channel 3. Ashland. The owner of a couple of the buildings where this happened says they have filed a police report and they will be adding security cameras to the area.